All right, so this is my pitcher. Um, same name as my center fielder. Just obviously not the same position on a different team, on a team that I don't want them to be on, Minnesota Twins. They stunk last year. And what they kept doing, because I'm only 70 overall, um, I guess they didn't feel like I was good enough for the MLB, so they would send me up for one week and send me back down for two weeks and just kept bouncing around. Um, I stayed in the MLB for the last month of the season because they were already eliminated from the playoffs. So I ended the season like, I don't know, 8-0 with a 9.9 something ERA. So it was, it was all right. Um, I got a minor league contract in off season, so it's just I think it's gonna be more of the same. Where I try to work my way back to the major leagues and, and stay there, but I've already asked to get traded. I'm gonna go to the Cubs, but I may have to wait for my overall to get higher. So my pitcher, his videos are gonna be gameplay plus uh, like tips. Uh, my center fielder not so much because I mean it's simple but I like I like the pitching more I also like what I uh, just giving tips things I've learned work for both computer and for the for humans depending on who you're playing against uh, in any mode Road to the Show or uh, Diamond Dynasty or online so Every team enters game one of a new season with high hopes. A manager offers words no. to mark the occasion Tell us of a new season. This beginning. is a new season. Pep talk. Okay. I don't even think I'm in the major league, so play next appearance. Oh. So they had me as a reliever, even though I was a starter. So I don't even know if it'll be worth the video. Because I don't know how long I'm going to stay in. I made this being for one inning. But this, my picture, like my center fielder, is continuing from 2016. And that's, it's worth noting. Um, I'm going to tell you why in a little bit when you see my pitches. So yeah, actually, my, my area was a lot lower. I thought it was 0.9, it was 0.23. So yeah, that was pretty good. Got the Raleigh Fingers mustache with the uh, Jesus beard and hair. Jesus, no, I'm not gonna say that. But I'm hooking in. Now some action out in the Minnesota. Pen. So you can see from my pit selection, I didn't really think much through. Lorenzo, just from last year. I picked the Vulcan change because I like the way it sounds, and it's like a change up, a little more movement. Hitters to do much with pitches in that location unless they're looking for it. And there's our number one. If I could go back, I obviously would have picked a regular changeup because it's more downward movement. Um, I really don't like that much Stepping movement on a changeup. It just doesn't seem like much of a changeup so anymore. In the game. Um, obviously, the fastball. Way in front of that 100 miles per hour. Well, these Tops out at 102. Heavy dose of that big I'm running fastball. Let's see how fast. I think 98. <laughs> 97. I've thrown that 102 before with my perk, uh, the little extra perk, which you should get if you're a pitcher. It's great. It works for one batter. And this is swung on and missed. So it's big speed difference between all my pitches, which is why you got to have a change up. My Vulcan is like 85, 86. With with the little extra perk, it can get up to 90. Um, both my fastballs can get up to 102. With the perk, First pitch coming. Here it is. There's that one was 101 without the perk. Um, that one missed, but but if it's a strike, let me tell you why I, I picked the running fastball last that year. Pitch, you have to really in previous to hit a shows, the shows, the, the inside running inside fastball one and one, here it is. was arguably the most and underrated pitch in the game. Time. If you're a right-handed batter or a right-handed pitcher, the running fastball moved like a left-handed slider. It had that much movement. And that was pretty unrealistic, especially if you're throwing it as fast as I'm throwing it. Ooh, he hit that. Alright. But, yeah, so it, there's not much difference between the running fastball and the two-seam fastball. So, it's like I'm kind of stuck with it. But at the same time, I'm not really complaining because I probably would have picked a two-seam fastball anyway. 
Oh, and one. Um, Here it comes. As you can see, I only have three pitches. At home plate. Four, two, our I don't want to pick we play inning number five. my other ones until I have these at the level that I want them. And I'm pretty close. Chopped at the plate. That rolls foul, so a good job to um, find it off and stay alive. Here comes another 0 2. Got him swinging. I'll say that's that will maybe something you want to do. They take me out. Okay, then. Digging in and looking for more. Yeah, that's something maybe I'd say you want to do. I'm about to do the little yeah, start part, things out just to show you how fast I go fast. Um, we're going to throw running fastball. Hide away. First offering on its way. Takes See, that was 102. Um, you think the fastball would be like 104, but it's not. I think it maxes out 102. Should have went to first. And there's okay. your first out. But that's exactly yeah, what they wanted out of that pitch up at this. But yeah, with the three pitches, the I want to wait till I, I get them get to, to where I want them so before I switch, before I add pitches, because well, I don't want you pitch know pitches aren't cheap. Omar I don't want to have like a, a fourth in. pitch and it's just Second neglected because I'm trying to develop those three pitches. Line, it's strike one. So I'd say that's something you might want to do, especially. On one count. Here's the pitch. Uh, Change up gets him out in front for strike two. It's just a good idea. Cause I mean you. Here it comes now to if you if you have four pitches and none of them are mastered, Fernandez then why do you have it. four pitches? Two gone. It's, it's a lot cheaper and easier and faster to develop three pitches first. So by the time you're adding a fourth pitch, you got three go-to pitches. Here's so that's something Gentry. you might want to think about. I don't know why I have the catcher suggestions. I'm just I'm just following them because uh. First pitch on its way. A high fastball is in there. I'm doing that's a video. Right there. It could change that bat. When thinking. you're facing a good hitter like this, that Ooh. first pitch, strike one, is so important as to who's gonna control this at bat. Right now, so my the rest of my pitches, um, I already have a Vulcan change, so I'm not sure if I'm gonna do a 12-6 curve, just because it has the same, it has similar amount of drop and more speed with both. Now a swing and he popped uh, I have the running fastball, so I'm not going to do two seamer. And Mauer will look up and put it away. And that ends the inning. I'm definitely going to do a cutter, which I can't wait till I like, get it, so I can do a video on why the cutter is one of the best pitches in the game. I don't think I'm going to do a changeup, but I still am going to mention why that's one of the best pitches in the game, more so against humans. Ready for another chance? Philip okay, so I'm a nice little middle reliever that they're using me since I have uh, starting reliever stamina. So I guess I'll take that. But it would be nice to, you know, get wins. I'd rather be in AAA getting strikeouts. Because last year I was averaging like 12 strikeouts a game. And I actually had a 12 inning perfect game. And I was, I was actually... Happy to lay off that it happened and it's even up at two because um the coach kept me in because I was had a perfect game so I'm like I wonder how long this game is going to continue last the 12 innings my team scored two runs and I finished it out had 16 strikeouts perfect game 12 innings so it was pretty good um but it was my leagues for KC in the seventh and standing in here's the first baseman Eric Hosmer. So, now here's the pitch. yeah, I, I really want to talk about the, the cutter, but I'm, I want to wait ball. until I, you can actually Seventh see it. Inning here at the ballpark, four, two, I mean, obviously score. you know what a cutter does, but I want to be able to show you while I'm talking and why it's the best pitch. It. But I can talk about the changeup, why I like it over the Vulcan change. I mentioned it before, but the change is more, Dribbled to the right side. it's just That's straight down. Ball. The Vulcan change has a little bit of a curve. It's almost like a fast curveball. Got him. And maybe that's the perk of it, but I just I wouldn't have had it. If I was starting, over, I wouldn't have had it. Right back um, slider is another great pitch. I may get that. Into straight away right. Trumbo has a read See, I'm thinking cutter and slider. Those probably be my next two pitches. So they go down without and a here. The maybe, no, I don't want to do a sinker. I have a, if, oh, my cutter, and I want it to be the max out speed. I don't know how fast it is. If I were to guess, maybe 96, 97. The left fielder, Alex and if Gordon, I could have, I want to max out the speed and the movement. So it would be deadly. Uh, a second one. Yeah, that's the reason why I could do it. So I'm going to keep here comes the first pitch. 
Swung on and missed. Pitching now form. By that Which, whether you're doing Road to the Show or Diamond Dynasty with a creative player, I'd recommend this pitching form for many reasons. So the form is Pedro Stroke. Uh, he's the reliever on the Cubs. And real life, he's just really fast. Uh, delivery, and he throws fast. He's the right 96. That's a pretty like impressive that. pitch from a young arm like that. And you can spot your pitch I like his form because it's for his delivery because it's just so fast. You're going to have a lot of strikeouts. And then when someone's on base, it's it's a little bit fast. It may be the same, but either way, it's really fast. Here's the catcher, um, Salvador Perez. So no one's trying to steal off. And you know what? I think this is a new feature this year where you can choose when to like rush your delivery. And with Pedro Stroke, stroke Swarm, you don't have to do that. And the thing is, when you when you do that, uh, the rush the delivery option, delivery. I forgot what it's called. But I think it lowers your accuracy for a chance. Right so He's with this form, it's like you don't have you don't have to do that option. Um, so yeah, that's why I always choose Pedro Strokes form. My uh, my guy on, on Diamond Dynasty is the same thing, and no one steals from the second out of the inning. And I don't know how I'm not even listening because it's Mike Mustakis. First two men in the All inning right, have both gone down via the punch out. So we'll actually, I like this being like a, a long reliever. It's just my team sucks. They don't score. Big swing Twins are such a joke. Well, actually, in real life, I think we're doing it right in real life. I think they're in the top one. Are they in the AL Central? I think so. Go home. Very weakly on the ground. Throw on to Mauer will be in time, and that retires the side. They're probably gonna take me out. Wow, Here's how they had me in the ninth. The shortstop. They'll try and lead things Shortstop. off here in inning number nine. I guess it's because of my stamina. They see that I'm okay. This is interesting. I want to see how long they're gonna keep me in the major league. Major leagues with this. I've thrown 50 pitches as a reliever. It's like, how long am I gonna stay like this? Now a swing and a ball popped high in the air over toward foul ground. Because we'd be winning right now if I was the starter. Put it away just past the first base dugout, and that's out number one. Striding in once again, Omar Infante. He got under one and popped out his last time. Um, since I have the running fastball, here's a tip of bases are empty, one man out. Really maximizing the the value of it. Um, it works better, I think, for humans, just because you have the, the error and the obviously computer knows what pitch is coming. But I like the move. It's more so with the two seam fastball. But if you put it right in here, the 0-1 pitch. You see where it ended up. But to a human, they see the initial movement of it breaking, and they're like, "Okay, this is going to be a ball." And a lot of times it'll either freeze them up or to give them they get a really late swing because they're like, oh man, it's I know what it is now, and they swing late. That's why I like the two seamers and the running fastball, um, especially if you have a slider. And a lot of times I would make the slider a setup pitch to where I deliberately throw a slider right in this area or this area initially, maybe on the first or second pitch. And then, so you make the running fastball a strikeout pitch, and they're like, oh, it's a slider. And by the time they realize what it actually is, it's too late. Oh, I've never done this. Um, so that's why the running fastball, two seam fastball, that's to me their maximum value. And a nice job here to come that's in that's slam the their door. value, the first save of their the optimum season. value is in that situation. Lap. Especially against a human. Obviously, it can freeze up a computer, but it's just. I don't know. It doesn't feel as sincere when you freeze up the computer. My pitches are off. This is wrong. Because I pitched like uh, 55 pitches, 56, and it says only through 43. <sighs> Level up. I did have one in. Mm -hmm. How do you explain?